The big guns are moving in. The 20-foot barrels of the US Marine self-propelled howitzers loom up in the green light of a night scope camera. The Allies are about to launch their heaviest strike yet against Iraqi ground forces. The long guns point north into Kuwait. The Marines fuse their 200-pound anti-armor shells. Mechanics are second nature. It's the mental preparation that's new for men who've never seen action before. I have a little bit of butterflies in the stomach because you want to do everything right and get it done safely and get out of there. Hit them, hurt them, and leave. The gunners set their sights on an Iraqi supply depot six miles inside Kuwait. The coordinates punched into a computer that makes these guns the most accurate weapon in their arsenal. At a minute to midnight, the howitzers spat out their opening salvos. Inside 13 minutes, the howitzer battery loosed off 72 rounds. The lack of enemy response suggested they'd hit their mark. Even so, they moved out fast to avoid detection. For the Marines, hit and run is the battle cry. Jeremy Thompson, ITN in eastern Saudi Arabia.